Considering why it's... don't why don't we get paid at the same time? Yeah. You know? I get that. Because I don't know if that, uh, you know, if her thing works or not. I don't know why she needs the gem exactly right now, but if it does... The reason one of them would need a gem is to put it in a lightsaber. Okay. Ugh. I mean, that's, it, that's better than it sitting in a display case, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or going into that, in, what was it one guy funny on doing? Industrial laser? Maybe. I don't remember. That Either sounds way. like something they'd do. Either way, though, the faster this whole transaction is done with, the more comfortable I'll feel. <laughs> and why did she go to you? I'm guessing it can be fit in there. Everyone else was a bidder. There's probably going to need to be rolls done for this. <laughs> that's some deceptive. That's some deceptive shit right there. No. Okay, is this de- um, it's deception. I think it's against cool discipline. Cool or discipline, I think. I uh, think charm is against cool, and all the rest are against discipline. Let me check deception. No, they begin with a D, Jordan. There it is. Uh, see page 113 for Jack of all uh, da, 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 da. Uh, Discipline, yeah Damn, Rekcha Yeah, I succeeded and I gave myself a bigger headache in the process <laughs> ah, 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 ah. Uh, You would have healed that over the four days anyway Right, I'll, I'll heal it back headache. down the two Okay, and you need to make your deception check well, actually, well, the deception difficulty would be based on her discipline. Yeah, which is basically two purples right, right now. Two, two so you didn't need to roll, don't worry that. will be helpful. Okay. Seems like Lana's telling the truth. Mm. She's sincere. It was just, a, just a coincidence, son. I mean, Raka and I were getting drunk at the open bar, and who talks to droids? Yeah. It seemed like we were getting ready to leave anyway, so, you know. Yeah, yeah. We've got enough problems, why not get rid of the gym? You know, the faster that's done. Rakchar will like yell out from like the uh like the uh where he is the quarters do we have a way of dealing with customs when we arrive at Doros I don't even know anything about that world it sounds familiar Duro it's the place where Duros are from they sound familiar <laughs> too we went right past it when we passed Corellia right past what I wasn't Duro. looking out the window well, we were in hyperspace anyway. Okay. It's it's by Duro. It's in the core. Did the data pad say where we had to deliver it here at the planet, or just like just? Uh, just the data there? pad did give you a location. I just didn't have one in mind at the time, so whatever. Okay. You have a location. Cool. It's not on planet though, because very few Duros live on pl- live on Duro anymore. Okay. It is a. Basically, pollution taken to the nth degree type world. It's yeah. kind of shitty. So it's in the same system, just uh, just uh same sector as Corellia. Okay, they're okay. pretty much beside each other. Basically, as far as systems in, gal- go. in galactic terms, yes. Okay. Yeah, the two they're, systems are close. They are to each other what Alpha Centauri is to us. Okay. Yeah, basically. And then, uh, okay, then there's a pause from the quarters, and then, have you fixed Jay yet? Are we just gonna like wait until? Like, does his input matter? Honestly, <laughs> is there nothing against Jay, but in our current situation, I'd rather him know as little as possible about what's going on here. Well, won't he just, like, wake up naturally and recover from, like, the shock? His repair like, both will handle that. Okay, so he's going to wake up then while we're on route then, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. 
Well, then he's going to know anyway, so your statement there. Okay, got it. Just just let him handle it. I I have no idea the extent of the damage that will execution to do him. Is there even a way to, like, repair? Yeah, you can make damage? a mechanics check. It would basically wake him up, and he'd be back down to... He'd basically get... I, you basically lose one strain and be awake. Uh, Fine, it's probably better that I... I'm just surprised that being not awake doesn't count as rest. You're not awake. You were forced to... It's like if you, could, get, if you get knocked unconscious, you, you're not really sleeping if you're knocked unconscious, right? I can could, I could see how you would maybe recover it after a while, but... Yeah. To be fair, you haven't exactly been put in a rest of state while you're at rest. You've been bouncing on the Wookiee's back for a while. <laughs> I don't think Jay notices. Not, no. <laughs> if you want to make a mechanic check, you can like hotwire Jay to start restart. Is that a two, three, one, two? <sighs> fine, fine. Let's let's fix it. Uh, okay, I'll keep a track of that. So I'll keep track of that threat. Dad, uh, yeah, Jay is turned on, and uh, he's actually gonna lose. He's actually you make a we make a spot repair along the way. He regains six strain. Welcome to being not offline. What happened? <sighs> You're gonna want to, I guess, extra sit down or just stay lying down. <laughs> extra sit down. Oh fuck! I don't like the sound of that. Who died? Re- Rector is gonna like come out of the quarters. Oh no. thank goodness! <laughs> <laughs> oh thank goodness! <laughs> oh, okay, so if no one died, who fucked up? Okay. okay, there's good news and bad news. Right, right, right. Oh, yeah, I'm waiting for the bad news. The Let's good start- news is we found a buyer <laughs> for the gem. Okay, that does sound like good news. The bad news is we couldn't deal with the bank account, so we had to give half of that up. What? <laughs> <laughs> you, you, we needed somebody to take care of it there, and there's only a limited number of people we could trust to, you know, take care of our affairs since we had to leave immediately. Okay, so who do we have to take care of it? <laughs> right, sure. like, Don't worry about that part so much. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, oh, not, definitely that, not Aaron. Right, Char will, like, just, like, mutter, like, uh, not understanding. I think it was Aaron Shin. Didn't you say it was Aaron Shin? <laughs> yes, it was that lovely little Pantoran woman. Is that Lana Pantoran? just kind of face right. palms? <laughs> right, Pantoran. I can't remember. So you look... <laughs> the alternative was they were going to confiscate it when the account comes up fake in a day or two anyway. I'm shutting back down. Wait, 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 wait. I'm, I'm glad to see that you're okay, Jay. Hmm. I'm glad to see you're not dead. Hmm. Your droid friend seems rather bombastic. He's Which one of you? Who the oh. fuck are you? <laughs> <laughs> Rector like calls out, You were right, B! 100%! <laughs> Nailed it! I guess you could consider That's... me the buyer. Rector. Well, we've got a buyer lined up! How much? Hmm. Uh, I'll let I'll let them say I've already got the gem. Fifty. Thousand, thousand, not fifty, thousand. <laughs> okay, okay, fifty that we don't have to launder or fence or anything like that. It's on the ship right now. Correct. In our hands. I say okay. fifty. J opens fire. What up? Oh. <laughs> 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 like short circuits. That's why Rector makes sure not like it happen. Like the thousand, thousand, thousand. Well, yeah, Jay at least sees a bright side in that. <coughs> he probably nobody, a nobody's side. no middleman's dipping their hands in it. Nothing. That and Lana did a great job of escaping the atmosphere of Cloud City. We didn't have to fight and harm the ship in the process. Minor I, detail, they do know which ship it was. And another minor detail, <laughs> Aaron Shin... Spawn. Aaron Shin's probably going to seek vengeance. He Fuck was him. planning to have us killed. Well, then I'm planning to have him killed. Yes, it would have been great if we could have taken the time to kill him back while we were right? there. <laughs> however, uh, however, the dr- J was a bit indisposed <laughs> at the moment. If Jay wasn't indisposed... I would have loved to kill Aaron back. Okay, you so know, what, Jay what holds up. What the hell up... happened at the museum? 
<sighs> we got spotted. There was a shootout. We grabbed the gem and ran. Uh... Ragtar actually Besides, has a recording of it. Ran. Yes. Was there another <laughs> shootout? Hey? Ragtar has an amazing display of how this went from his point of view, of how Jay opens the door and then, shit, kill the lights! <laughs> <laughs> Basically, the whole thing makes Jay look pretty bad. And, and then when he's they, like, can I have a copy? Ragtar says, well, you did let all the Tabata gas on board the ship be. Uh, best two out of three. But we're also going to sell that gas. Well, you did I do something to impress me. It. How about if you come up with something else in the next four days to impress me? I'll let you have uh, a copy. Hmm. Yeah, about that, Tabana. I don't think we're actually selling it if we're going through with the original plan. No, I. All it all it said was deliver it, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And yeah, I, I think this is stolen Tabana gas. I I don't we've we've I don't want to push luck any. Look, we've already stolen a hut's money. We already have another hut ship that we've stolen. We also stole his gem that he paid said money for. And he stole his money. Yes. He basically paid for this thing twice now and still doesn't have it. <laughs> so in the grand scheme of things, if we could, we're already going to have errand after us. We're never going to be able to return to Cloud City. If we could possibly avoid making any more enemies today or in the next four days. Well, uh, yeah. There are, lit there's literally a limit to how many people I can punch before I'm taken down. And we almost met that threshold today. Yes, we did. Uh, enemies we, enemies wielding stun blasters that can auto fire you know you know kudos to them the private security force they would know they would fucking know mm -hmm. they got close too they did anyways if if i hadn't increased uh, my level of soak you know who who can say what would have transpired yeah actually one more of those hits would have went through if you hadn't yeah uh I uh I chose to upgrade soak with the experience points that we got last session, so I think that was a I think that was a decent enough decision. <laughs> no regrets. Anyways, <laughs> even though even though it's only been two hours, roughly roughly two almost three hours right now, I think we're gonna end the session here because this is a good spot because of the end of the adventure path they had written out for you guys. Okay. And okay. so the start of next session then picks up dealing with the consequences, like the complications from mm -hmm. this session. Okay. Well, you're already well. You're already getting complications from this session. Your obligation is being risen by five because I have a bounty put on you by someone. I, I, I wonder I, who. I, I can't imagine oh. it would have been Aaron Shen at all. No, I, I, I'm being honest. I can't decide which one. Probably hates the yeah, more. Be it's, so many people. It's mostly an overall just bounty that's being placed upon. Oh. Who is the? Who looks like the leader of this troop of miscreants? Lissa was, I, Lissa was identified as the suspicious one whenever we went to yeah, the Yeah, Lissa act. looks like the leader. Yes, there is a bounty put on Lissa's head. It is not a. It's not dead or alive. It's wanted alive for questioning. Yeah, Calpo and Aaron went together to make this bounty. You know, it might actually even be from Cloud City too. It's. Maybe. Yeah, it's it stems from Cloud City, so it's a legit bounty. Damn. So it's not actually a criminal thing, it's just a... Uh, no, that would, that would be criminal obligation. Okay. It's a straight-up bounty. Yeah. Straight-up bounty. Wanted for questioning. Isn't that right, Train? Wanted for questioning. Well, yep. uh... The, Train's all, got your answers. All, all things being sold, the session went better than expected. <laughs> you guys have, went you guys exactly have, as expected. You guys have 50,000 credits to your name right now. Plus uh, whatever you had left over. Isn't that By the right, end of the right? four days, does anything from the uh, bank account come through, like a first payment? Nothing from the bank account yet, but okay. you will. But by the end of the four days, you will. You will get. You will get what's left of your winnings, which is roughly twenty thousand credits. So seventy income so far. Mm -hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa! That twenty's mine. No, I'm You're a droid. I'm, I'm fucking <laughs> with you.
Technically, technically, it went to Lana's account because Lana's the one who put up her. Is yours or Derwin? You were the owner of the race car, apparently. Uh, all right, that's fourteen thousand. <laughs> It's fourteen thousand for each uh, each party member, and then fourteen thousand for the ship. Let's wait to divvy things up until we okay. get to our destination. All right. Mm -hmm. Like until it gets time to actually start spending and money. And for sure. the end, and for the end of the session, since you achieved everything that was the adventure path set out, everyone gets twenty experience points. All right. Even for the short session, because that's you guys basically from the get go said Aaron Shen, fuck that guy. Pretty much. Pretty much. We get 20 experience for that? Yeah. Man, I need not, to hate on more not, people. Not just that, but because you basically dealt with Aaron Shen, who was supposed to be, like, a big part of Part 3. I mean, I, I, I didn't, you know, I didn't, like, want to, like, screw him over, but when Aaron pretty much appears and says that he's, <laughs> he will hire goons, he's already hired goons to kill you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, he might have been a part, big part of Part 3, but because of the way the heist went, we never even got to the real Part 3, I guess. Yeah, and you guys didn't accrue enough threats or despairs for me to make actually make Wingard actually drop down on you. Huh. Right. I like, had a number I had a number in my head. It was 10. You got, Not even when the alarm goes off, does it get doubled? It basically adds one per turn. You guys got to 9 before they actually were attacking you. So, so those advantages that were put in the bucket of <laughs> threats. Yes, they did help. So, it's a good thing that Jay just said, fuck it, we can't waste any more time. In theory? Otherwise, more rolls would have yeah. been made. I mean, mind you, I mean, mind... Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Well, not not just and more rolls would have been made. The silent alarm had already gone off. Yeah. Yeah, but they silent alarm... You were accruing was, stuff either way. Silent alarm was different than the loud alarm. The loud alarm is... Everyone knows. The silent alarm is just like, oh, we'll send a patrol car or two, you know? Right, it could have just been an accident or an incident. We need to investigate the sea. The loud alarm goes off too. It's everyone goes in guns blazing. As long as you stand by the telephone and somebody hits that button, you're fine. <laughs> How do I internet? But they might send out a patrol car. It's like then yeah, the time clock. <laughs> the time clock just went off, guys. I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> what were the codes for today? So yeah, that uh, uh oh, point of no return. So all, all things being told, that went all right. We uh, managed to get the banking droid. We uh, managed to uh, you managed to defeat Lobot. In theory. Even after that fucking spike screwed up. Because you put in the wrong port, right? Yeah. Wrong port. That's where that's where that's where the vast majority of these threats actually started coming from. Lobot was paying more attention. That's yeah. Let me just put it in this perspective. Had you guys, the, the actual increase in patrolling meant that the Sky Guard was, it dropped down the number of uh, threats you guys needed from 15 to 10. Uh, Basically, so well, you guys could have gotten, you guys could have gotten away with more shit had you know, not fucked up the slice. Mm. Thanks, Alyssa. Yeah, Thanks, yeah. Alyssa. <laughs> as far as you know, she succeeded. Because I did so much. <laughs> Says Lana, who basically fell down a shaft and then just said fuck it and then basically gave in to the first bidder who walked up to her and says I want the gem well, the motive. Jet, I think. yeah we don't know those yeah, and I, if Jay I, did know those he'd be cross well Lissa, Lissa does know that they, that Eliza is a yeti and that we could, so side note I, um, isn't the suspicion. point of those robes that they blend in just about anywhere because they're super common in the Star Wars universe a large part of it's to identify them as basically diplomats. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is she wearing the variant that has like the little armor plates hidden inside of it? No. Okay. That's old. I was gonna school. say that could be a way to look at. It. It's oh, old school, but it, you, you, that's what that's what the triumph basically comes. If you get success, it's like I remember something from my history books about some people who wore that, but can't place it. Triumph's like Jedi. Yeah. This is basically uh, fucking Jedi. You let a Cheddar monk on board the ship? You're just as bad as B. <laughs> hey, at least I got... Oh, man. He's like, he's like at least I got I some... I suppose the, the silver lining of failing so hard in the sewers... And the only reason I dropped out was basically I was coming up on my strain threshold right. very quickly. Um, but at least, you know, the silver lining is the ship was ready to go for when things did go badly. Mm. So I guess that's something. 
Yeah. I, 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 I mean, I completely understand why you did, and uh, you uh, handled your uh, your non-combat lifting in the sessions, which uh, led up to this anyway. Mm-hmm. And non-athletic lifting. <laughs> 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 Basically things that don't involve lifting. Me, oh, I, right. me, I finally got to punch people after so many sessions, and it felt good. It felt good. Good. You fucking, killed a man. I fucking one shot of that goddamn nemesis. <laughs> I maybe he was a rival. He was a rival. All right. All right. Uppercut. Right. I know. Fucking like uppercut him. Private security's like fuck that Wookie. Said blasters to stun. <laughs> the blasters only stun. Ah. Uh, yeah, they're, they're riot right. guns. They were riot guns. They're basically designed to quell. They're basically designed as they take you in for questioning later because they can't prosecute you if you're dead. Right. The private security doesn't have the authority to just murder people. <laughs> no. You know, I I didn't they know, like, do. private security for a clearly corrupt, you know, imperial, like, administrator and bureaucrat? I didn't know what they could do. Yeah, same here, actually. Whatever they want. The droid was also programmed to, uh, stun... He's the wild card yeah, that murders. I, I, I imagine I would have had a fucking great sinning thing. So you uppercut killed a man in one hand. <laughs> they show video footage of that. Uh, the video you literally from, punched that man's head off. The video footage from your own helmet. <laughs> Damning proof. <laughs> you literally accrue uh, evidence against you everywhere you go. <laughs> well, then clearly I could expect Calfo the Hut. To free me from prison so that, you know, he could place me under a great obligation to do things for him. <laughs> a Wookiee life debt to a, a hut. Oh, that would not be a life debt. <laughs> be a I, don't, I don't even understand what those are. That's true. Yeah. No. What are was, those things? It was certainly entertaining and apocalyptic. Uh, I loved how quickly everything just went to shit. <laughs> That's how it goes when you steal things, though. Well, I mean, that was that was a pretty fucking serious heist. We stole the jewel hey. of Yavin. The well, you say things went to shit, but we kept to plan and succeeded. More or less, <laughs> not as much as we would have hoped. No it plan. Sur- no plan am, survives I'm... contact with the enemy. It did, though. First contact with the players. It did work. It definitely worked. It did work. Man, I would have loved to kill Aaron first. I'll kill him back. Right? We might, we might get the chance at some point in the future. We're never going to be able to get fucking close to that damn bureaucrat. <laughs> he might travel. Even though I can't personally condone tracking him down for revenge. Jay wants to kill him by kicking him off the edge into Bespin. Look, we already saw how motivated he could be when he was motivated by vengeance. That's what this entire Jewel of Yavin plot surrounded. Vengeance. Yeah. And we basically robbed him of all of his vengeance. Like, now the entire transference of vengeance went from Grayson to us. Those. Well, fuck him. <laughs> yeah, fuck him if you can't take a joke. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good joke. Oh. Uh, I mean, I'm perfectly willing to kill him if he's that's what he wants. Oh, Chris, if you're willing to do that, I can totally have that conversation because time is right now and it's yeah. fine. It's like this is something that won't take more than, you know, four days of time. Right. Oh, yeah. So you folks can have that since since Rakchari isn't gonna hear it and he's not gonna fucking care because he doesn't care even if he was told I'm pretty sure like okay yeah Jedi what the fuck are those those are legends right <laughs> okay yeah okay yeah sure who you le- fucking mind oh wait things. you mean you mean she is just a figment of my imagination I God, think yeah. that Jay probably literally hasn't heard of Jedi you could probably not he's one like, to find out he's four. And he has no education. That's right. There, there is, there is no need to make a role for that. Like, if he says his character is no shit. All right. He's, he's been programmed yeah. not to know. But a great or, job, Team PC. Great job. Well, yeah. Well, look, he doesn't have any points in education, and he's four years old. He's probably never even heard of Jedi. Okay. Well, 
Eliza's, Eliza's not exactly going to hide the fact that she is one because she's basically outright repairing a lightsaber on the table in the other room. Yeah. You know what? Jay, wait, I, I didn't mean to heal. Recruit all the strength, <laughs> fuck you. Uh, oh. Recover strain. There we go. Jedi. Because I assume that he'll have recovered all of his strain by the start of the next session. Why do you have one strain? Because our obligation is going to pop. Yeah, because That's right. we've, we had at, we've had that for All right, every not mine. So not mine. <laughs> Actually, that is yours. Wait, no, it, no it's not. I, 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 I guess maybe it is. Maybe it is 16. JL, no, it's, it's Lissa's. Hooray! And it's actually this one, the last this one you just got. Oh, the great, they're chasing us. Okay, so Jay's actually going to get super curious and be like, what are you making? Mm. That's, uh... Mm. Yeah. I would be spending a lot of time trying to talk to Eliza as well. What, what, what is that? She's not, because she's not going to respond because she's too busy, you know... Making is things, that, making things float, and putting them into specific positions. Is that a type of blaster? Mm, How are no. you making it float like that? Don't worry about it, dear. It's better if you don't. I know. think you have one too many focusing chambers. That's just that's not going to go anywhere. Mm. The Karuska gem has actually gone from its like fist size fist <laughs> size thing down to a much smaller, you know. No, like, it looks like a barber Cut shop up. where there's shavings all over the grass. <laughs> no, let's collect them up. <laughs> no, seriously, let's collect them up and sell them. Mm, Eliza's gonna Eliza's gonna look at you funny if you about to, if you pick those up. <laughs> okay. Yes. No. I do technically still own them, but okay. I, I mean if. It was trash once it hit the ground. <laughs> if you want to keep them, fine. I would paid. thank you if you. I would thank you if you picked them up off the floor. I would also tell you what this item is. I could probably tell. All you right. Check. I'm very curious. It's a lightsaber. I don't know what is that like a vibro. <sighs> He's just, just gonna, he's gonna step away from everyone and then turn the thing on, and it glows a vibrant green. Rex, Rex, Re will like call in from like the quarters. Did I hear a lightsaber? No, oh. dear. <laughs> wow, it sounded exactly like a lightsaber. <laughs> How's it stay coherent like that? Mm. Uh. Blah, blah, blah. Science mumbo jumbo about how it makes a pla it makes a blade of plasma. Magnets actually. Blade of, magnets, a blade yeah, of plasma right. contained by an electromagnetic field. Yeah, yeah. You know, magnets. Hey, hey, maybe Eliza doesn't understand science. Did you fucking totally consider reasonable. that? <laughs> I don't yeah, fucking know. My bastard just taught me how this worked. I don't. Fuck. <laughs> oh, she knows how it works. Okay. She's not trained, but she's definitely smart. Do like basically. Electric magnetic field holding a blade of plasma in place, using the Karuska gem as a basically a lens for the power source. Wouldn't it short out as soon as it touched anything? Mm, what do you mean, the blade? Yeah. No. Here, let me show you. <laughs> Hold out your hand. We'll, sh we'll show you. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and then she turns out and says, I'm kidding, dear. Ha ha ha. Uh, let me just let me just tell you. Let me just tell you. A Jedi. A, let me just tell you. A lightsaber is probably one of the most deadly weapons you'll ever see. Really? Mm-hmm. Did I hear deadly weapons? I'm really yes. interested in those. I could have sworn you said lightsaber. <laughs> it's not a lightsaber, dear. I've got some research to do. Right, Reg Char like like rumbles and I heard deadly weapons. I'm really interested in deadly weapons. Like passes, yeah, there's a deadly man. weapon in the kitchen. All right, deadly weapon. <laughs> In the kitchen. Uh, Lyza's gonna, gonna like strap the thing back under her hip. Yes, I am a deadly weapon, Rekchar. Rekchar <laughs> looks at Eliza, blinks because he has his armor on. But I can believe that. <laughs> and actually, like walks back away. <sighs> Poor Rekchar. This is the scene that has inspired Jay to try to get Cortosis armor. <laughs> really? How would he even know about Cortosis armor? That's why he walked away, saying that he had some research to do. 
research. And then, would, time later, he on, will get Cortosis On all of armor. the wonderful redacted sources about Jedi. Redacted, and, uh, redacted and Cortosis also being his. But oh, he won't be able to afford it for fu- fucking ages, let alone finding someone to get a hold of it. But this is the start. And actually, Cortosis is legal. This is where it all began. Hey, Cortosis only costs like 10,000 credits, matter of is it 20? I think it's 10. Yeah, because it is the uh, impure version of Cortosis that you can actually get. Yeah. Pure Cortosis, the kind that shorts out lightsaber blades, is unavailable. Right. So yeah, you'd be able, if you uh, put your money towards uh, that, when we actually did divvy up the creds. True the, part, the problem is finding someone who can do it. Oh yeah, dude, Cortosis is super not common. And also uh, I'll finding... look it up real quick. I think it's like and at any rate, yeah, I'm uh, I'm good for the the session. Then I uh, great job to uh, the players. Uh, glad you uh, decided to organize this, and uh, you're you found something that you enjoyed doing, Jordan. Mm-hmm. Rarity glad, eight. I'm glad you have a, I'm glad you have fun with it. All right. Went well. Maybe I'll send you a character sheet sooner than today. Okay. <laughs> sooner than to, that's not fucking possible unless I travel into the holy shit! I just blew my own mind. Mm-hmm. All right, that takes care of uh, Edge of the Empire. They might do some other stuff. They they tend to interact with each other like an hour or so more uh, after I disconnect. But I'm not interested in all of the uh, the nerdery about the expanded universe lore. I say nerdery in a uh, loving way. The uh, all of the the Star Wars stuff, the expanded universe, is not a, something that intrigues me that much. But I do enjoy the system, the dice rolling mechanics, the uh, narrative possibilities for roleplay, and I'm very glad that uh, we managed to prevail. I think it tells a great story, uh, especially since the obligation that was rolled ended up being uh, that they were coming after us. Since I got attached to Lissa, I think my numbers would be from 61 to 80. So, yeah. But now it can be Lissa instead. Or really, it's all of us. It's like a group obligation thing. They're looking for that armored big dude who's probably a Wookiee. Oh, good times. Really enjoyed this. Good times indeed.